Tom, the winds continue to pick up here in North Conway. As you can see behind me, there are two brave ice skaters out here tonight. They are all bundled up because, as we know, this night is only going to get colder. So people are being asked to keep an eye on pets and their neighbors. Pet expert Virginia Moore has a warning to all pet owners tonight. If they're outdoor pets, uh, make them indoor pets for the night. She says freezing temperatures can be deadly to animals, and that means keep walk short, five to ten minutes max. It's really hard on dogs' feet and very uncomfortable for them. To combat that, put booties on their paws and help shield the cold with a sweater. Anything to keep them out of the wind. We're talking wind chill tonight, so that's. That's the biggest threat. People need to bundle up too. It's a message the town's local senior center is sending out to its members. Dress in layers, wear a hat, don't let your flesh be exposed because when it's windy and cold, the frostbite can sneak up on you really, really quickly. Also, take a minute to check on the elderly. Checking your neighbor is one of the most important things you can do. The center's director tells us seniors need the most help at this time of year, especially when it's this cold. If you haven't like seen or heard from somebody in a while, or perhaps they're, you know, they're people that tend to, to isolate because a lot of seniors isolate in the winter time. Moore is also asking that people keep an eye out for stray animals. If you can, bring them to a shelter. Stray cats tend to get into trouble when it's this kind of temperature. If they're, they just don't have any place to get in. She also tells us to keep animals away from lakes and ponds. If the ice isn't safe, they could fall through. We're live in North Conway tonight. Kristen Carosa, WMUR News 9.